The Mortgage Minute today being brought to you by our friends at Geneva Financial. When you're ready for that next home loan, Geneva's got the programs and the products. You just need to make the call, 800-306-1990, 800-306-1990. S&P 500 now down 18.32. Ten-year Treasury is back over 4%. It's a 4.033. Mortgage-backed securities are down 27 basis points, which means interest rates are up ever so slightly. And OBMMI, they provide the most comprehensive, accurate, and timely information ever available in the mortgage industry. Why? Because it's calculated from actual locked rates. Locked rates with consumers across 35% of all mortgage transactions nationwide. Now, this does not tell you how many points somebody paid to get the rates. But conforming loans locked at 6.967 on Friday. The jumbo loan, 6.973. FHA loans locked at 6.801. 30-year USDA loans locked at 6.866 and the best loan on the market for those that earned it. The VA loan locked at 6.70 on Friday. Best loan out there. We appreciate our veterans. The question, though, is why is all of this happening? Well, there's a big issue going on right now, and most people don't understand it, so they won't talk about it. I understand it. I'll talk about it. Well, the issue that we're seeing right now is the fact that there is a bigger, a larger than normal spread on the mortgage-backed securities. I've told you before that mortgage-backed securities and the 10-year treasury, they track each other, but they do not set rates for one another. The mortgage-backed securities go on it, trade itself, and 10-year treasuries trade on their own market. So what is the deal? Why would I be even talking about this then? Well, because generally, there's about a 1.75 to 2.0 spread between the mortgage, the 10-year treasury and the 30-year mortgage rate. So if we're looking at, as I just shared with you, that the 10-year treasury is at 4.03, well, then we would expect that 30-year mortgage rates to be somewhere between five and three quarters and six. But no, I just got through telling you that OBMMI, which has the 35% market share, is saying that they're at almost seven. Why is that? Why is that happening? What's causing that? Well, It has to do with what the market is predicting for the future and can the the servicers who need to buy these loans, how long do they anticipate keeping them and what is the value of the servicing rights and what does the market see as the value of the bond itself? How long are they going to be able to keep that bond because they're anticipating a drop in interest rates? Again, like I've shared that with you before. We also look at the apartment list released their national rent report showing that rents fell by 0.7% in October. Do you believe it? They're now up 5.9% year over year, which is a significant moderation year over year from 18% last year, which was the fastest year of rent growth on record. Still estimated this year will, will be the second fastest year of growth. And I'm going to share a little personal information right here. Just a, just a little bit of personal information. So I've got a very dear one who just moved out of a two-bedroom apartment. They were paying, I think, at 20, $2,700 or $2,800 a month, twenty or seven, $2,800 a month in Anaheim Hills, California. Their lease was up, so they get a renewal saying that they're going to go to $3,050. And they said, adios, we're out of here. Now we see the exact, their apartment is now listed for rent available. You ready for this? Two bedroom apartment, two story, $3,500 a month, $3,500. So are rents going up or are rents going down? You be the judge of it. You tell me what your neighborhood is doing. That is the Mortgage Minute. Get your own mortgage. That way you know that your cost of living only goes one direction because if it's a 30-year fixed rate mortgage, it's going to stay the same for 30 years unless interest rates go down and you may take advantage of it and lower the rate. That's the Mortgage Minute brought to you by our friends over at Geneva Financial. When you're ready for that next home loan, 
Geneva's got the programs and the products. You just need to make the call, 800-306-1990, 800-306-1990.